Hello guys and welcome to When in Halifax and today's video is we will answer some common question and one of the common question is sir I'm currently in other country I'm not in the Philippines I'm currently as uh, working in other country as an OFW can I apply to AIPP so that's our question. So before we begin our discussion, guys, if this is your first time to watch our AIPP series and you want to learn more about AIPP, click the link on the description below and I'll send all the video directly to your messenger. So, be, uh, so let's begin. If you are currently in other country, you are working there as an uh, OFW, a foreign worker, uh, the question is, can you apply for AIP? The answer is yes. So there is no restriction whether you are in other country. If you are in Saudi Arabia, Abu Dhabi, or anywhere, you can apply for AIPP. Why? Because AIPP, guys, is employer-driven. Employer-driven means that the employer has the right to choose whoever or whatever she wants or he wants. It's an employer-driven. The decision for hiring is from, from the employer. It's not from the immigration. So if you are currently in other country, maybe it will be an advantage for you to find a good job because at least you have a good experience. The bottom line, guys, wherever you are, as long as you have a current experience, experience that under NOC 0, A, B, and C, you have the chance or you are eligible to apply for AIPP. So wherever you are, wherever you are, wherever country you are working right now, you can apply for I for AIPP. Another question, sir, you posted about the living in NB.ca about the um, information session and job fair that will be happening in Metro Manila this coming July and I'm currently in Saudi Arabia can I still apply for AIPP the answer is yes even guys that you are not invited for the information session you can still apply for AIPP because AIPP actually guys is employer driven employer driven means that the employer can decide to hire anyone that he needs or she needs okay so you can apply directly from your country where you're working if you're saying for example you are in Saudi Arabia you are currently working there as a truck driver and you are looking for a job in Saudi Arabia make it online everything is online so if you want to learn on how to find a designated employer and how to submit a resume from the list click the link below i put a link on the description below um it's very easy guys F find an employer or business name from the list and then go to a job bank search for your job position like truck driver um then there will be a list of employer make sure before you submit your resume make sure the employer or the business name or the company name are listed in the designated employer list so it's online guys if you have if you didn't uh if you're not able to attend the information session it's either your job is not listed in the noc list or you are not currently in the philippines you can still apply for a aipp you can apply it online so the um the one that i show you on how to find a designated employee apply it use it because that's the way you can make sure that the employer that you are applying are in the designated list. So guys, I hope you're able to find this helpful and informative. Please click the link. Follow us in our, uh, follow us in our Facebook page. Uh, like our Facebook page when in Halifax. Subscribe to our channel and join our Facebook group Pinoy Immigration forum by when in Halifax. See you again guys in our next video guys and bye-bye.